So, Brady, you brought along some kit here called I the did. NAVD. Tell us a little bit about this. Yeah, this is a NAVD. Can we zoom in on... Uh, there All right, this is a NAVD. So, so it's a visor that you wear on your head. Yeah, and this it's is a, kind of a replacement <laughs> for Daydream. Um, so NAVD really. is a company that went through the very first class of Highway 1. And they ran a crowdfunding campaign. And then they have released it this year. And they're selling tens of thousands of units. And what it does is you, you kind of mount it on your dashboard this way. There's a little projector here that then hits this mirror and then it looks like the apps are floating on the screen. And you can use this both with your Android phone, here's the app, but then the NavD device itself is running on a variant of Android. Oh, okay. And so- <laughs> Nice. When, so say it's here, open I wanna go to, exactly, yeah. <laughs> so like here, if I wanna go to Crepe Cone, Yummy. I can I could flick if this was attached, I would be able to just say, okay, that's my location, and then it loads on to the NavD, and then I can use this dial, which goes on your and steering wheel, on looks my like. steering wheel, uh, to move around through it and other gestures. So we have a video that kind of shows how it's being used. If we yeah. want to cue that up. Yeah, if you roll, there's a little Dropbox link there in the dock to roll the video but yeah so it kind of it projects it onto the screen and then yep. as you're kind of watching um calls come through and you can kind of like wave your hand to accept the call or what well, just like that yeah in fact. and so you can see it's floating in front oh oh <laughs> well okay it just decided to go away technical difficulties please stand by hmm. so there we so go. you can choose the route then you can choose what type of notifications you want. They call them glances. So you always keep the route up. And then, you know, you can change stations on Pandora, Spotify. You can get messenger notifications. And then you can speak to it to reply. Huh. And, like, when I... So it plugs into your ODP2 port. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it knows what's happening. It knows how fast you're going. And it knows if you're uh, running out of gas. So... Right. Sometimes when I'm driving along, it'll say, hey, you're almost out of gas. Do you want to add this gas station to your route? Neat. And then I just say yes. That's or I cool. hit, Or I click it, and then it just added it. I like that it keeps all this stuff in your view. Um, yeah. Kind of almost, I mean, it, you can see it's kind of projecting into the actual kind of glass that you normally, that, that you're looking mm -hmm. through while you're driving. But um, obviously it's transparent, so you're not really blocking anything and it keeps you from kind of looking away. Sometimes when you look at the screen, even if it's just like navigation stuff, I feel like I shouldn't be looking to, to read that this turn is coming you know, 0.3 miles down, down the way because I feel like in just my looking over here, it's actually taking my attention away from, from the driving. Yeah, you definitely have to make sure that you're not Focusing too much on it, you still yeah, need to for make sure. sure, but at least <laughs> it's not like a video ahead. game where you're, you're navigating and, and only it's looking better at it than the way. having a giant because I'm not a fan of the big displays in the cars. I'm mm -hmm. sorry, I know it's no. a big thing in the Tesla, yeah. but I'm not a fan of that. Mm -hmm. I like I like me regular tangible buttons and dials. That's what I like. And voice activation and not touching your phone, right? And no, yeah. okay. not touching my phone at all. <laughs> okay, and then here if we can zoom back in onto. <laughs> This, so I don't know if you guys can zoom in on the phone here, but I have a bunch of different app glances that I can sign up to oh. get messages and alerts, and I can choose if I want to get, I want to have it read out loud or just show the content. And then I also have destination favorites. And they're definitely looking for developers. So if you have an app and you want it and it works in the car, just head to navd.com. And these are for sale right now. Cool. So what? That's so cool. Yeah. That's, I mean, the, 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 yeah. I was always surprised that, that the heads-up display technology hasn't made it into cars yet, and so this way you you, you don't need to have it baked into the car; just attach yeah. it to whatever car you have. That's great. So yeah, and I mean, a big part of what they worked on was this. It's called a combiner. That's what that optical piece is. And so the CTO, the original CTO. He had worked on Pico projectors mm -hmm. and had oh. multiple patents, and that's how they got connected. Because mm. Doug, the CEO, who's in the video actually, uh, like he knew he wanted to do this, and he found Carl, 
uh, through his blog on optics. Where do people um, pick up one of these? Is it just, I mean, is it a through Navdi, the site? Navdi.com, but I, I'm, honestly, I haven't checked. I assume through Amazon as well. Okay. But they are now available. Nice. And being that it's plugging into your OBD mm -hmm. uh, port, I mean, that, that has the potential for passing all sorts of, all sorts of other diagnostics through yep. and, and all that sort of mm -hmm. stuff. So when you're talking about developers kind of developing for the platform, that probably opens up a whole host of opportunities. Which Android Auto does not do currently. Yeah. Yeah, that's a bummer. Well, it's, yeah. Yeah. It is. <laughs> uh, what's, it what's, is. Re what's really, what's, uh, what I think is really interesting and smart on Navdi's part, Brady, which I didn't even see that they had. I'm here I'm looking on the website. They're offering for some locations free delivery and setup. So yeah. like, you know, so not everybody is as, you know, kind of technically, uh, you know, as we are, that's really, that's really smart to kind of go to people. But then also it looks like that, you know, it's, it's fairly pricey. It's $7.99 price tag, but looks like they've got a $33 a month price, uh, you know, kind of uh, financing deal, similar to the Google Pixel financing deal we saw. That's smart as well, too, to make it right. more affordable. Right. Yeah, and if you cool. zoom in again here, uh, you can pick out, based on the car, there's a video telling you where the port is. Oh, cool. So that the installation is actually yeah. relatively simple. I mean, the OBD port is usually pretty darn easy to find, but a lot of people don't even know that it's I there. I don't know. Or that it I exists. don't even know yeah. where it is yeah, in it my exists. car. I've had my yeah. car for eight years. I don't know where it is. And it's that's no where it gets power from, is through that port. Oh, cool. Very neat. I love and, it. And I mean, so for me, this was the first class of Highway 1, and it was nice to have it come out. Yeah. You know, as I'm, as I'm leaving. And I got to, I was in the beta this summer, I was like, holy shoot, this is <laughs> like, this is really cool. Uh -huh. Like I did not know three years ago when I first, so when I first met them, their prototype was the size of a kitchen table. Like they were oh, using a real regular projector. And when they left, uh, it was definitely a bigger unit than when you see here, but then they had like a huge battery attached to it. Right. Oh my. And there was only one and it could only show static images. So They've just to see what they've done is awesome. But this is so this is powered by the car. Now what yeah. do you, what's it like when it's really sunny outside? Uh it you just see it floating. Like that is part of its magic. Is that it's bright enough to overcome yeah. kind of bright wow. sun, yeah. sunshine. I didn't have any I, no problems. <clears throat> no nice. problems. Excellent. Cool. That is the Navdi, Navdi.com to check that out. Uh, N A V D Y. N A V D Y. .com. And it was yeah. given out on Ellen. I saw Ooh, the yeah. Ellen branding. Oh yeah. On the oh yeah. Yep. There's some video of that too. So if you want to see uh, some excited people, <laughs> nice. God bless That's, Ellen. Uh, <laughs> taking over where Oprah left off. Yeah, yep. Right, right, yep. Right. My favorite thing. <laughs> Navdi. Excellent. Cool. Thanks for bringing that yeah, in. Yeah. Sure.